Jogu Online TV. Welcome. Well Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. I welcome you to this broadcast. And I believe wherever you are, you are blessed. And the Lord has been come to you. And I want to share briefly about uh, the person of the Holy Spirit. I want to speak about the Holy Spirit. He is uh, our friend. Yeah, the Holy Spirit is our friend. He is a gift from the Father. Praise the name of the Lord. Uh, I want to read from the book of John, chapter number 14 and verse 16. The Bible says, And I will ask the Father, and he will give you another comforter. Speaking about the Holy Spirit, he will give you another comforter that he may remain with you forever. Praise the name of the Lord. The Spirit of Truth, whom the world cannot receive, whom the world cannot welcome, whom the world cannot take to it at because it does not see him or know and recognize him but you know and recognize him for he lives with you constantly and will be in you praise the name of the lord when the holy spirit comes he, he lives in us yeah, he lives in us. Every Christian lives a, a, a victorious life because of the Holy Spirit whom the Father sent to the world. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. We see Jesus speaking here that he will ask the Father and he will give us another comforter. Amen. That the word comforter means counselor. Praise the name of the Lord. Means helper. Hallelujah. Intercessor. Advocate. Strengthener. Stand by. Praise the name of the Lord. So the Holy Spirit is our comforter he is our helper he helps us in our weaknesses praise the name of the lord because we are weak we are weak vessels without the holy spirit we cannot live a, 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 a christian life we cannot we cannot uh, be effective in our christian work praise the name of the lord but with the help of the holy spirit we can do a lot in the kingdom of God. Praise the name of the Lord. Without the Holy Spirit, the, the, we, we cannot do, do anything because he comes to help us. Praise the name of the Lord. So he said that he'll, he, he will uh, ask the Father and he will give us a comforter, the Holy Spirit, to be with us, to remain with us forever. Hallelujah. The Holy Spirit will remain with us forever. He will remain in you forever to reveal to you the things of God. Praise the name of the Lord. Even uh, also in the book of, uh, in the same book uh, of John chapter, the same chapter, chapter 14 and verse 25, the, the, Jesus said, I have told you these things while I am still with you. Verse 26, but the comforter, uh, the Holy Spirit, our counselor, our helper, our strengthener, our intercessor, our standby, the Holy Spirit, whom God, whom the Father will send in my name, will teach you all things. Praise the name of the Lord. That's one of the of the work of the Holy Spirit. He teaches us all things. Hallelujah. He will teach you all things. Praise the name of the Lord. Without the Holy Spirit, without the Holy Spirit. You cannot know the, 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 the will of God. You cannot not understand the word of God. Praise the name of the Lord. You cannot understand the mysteries of the word of God. 
or the mystery is in the word of God. Without the Holy Spirit, you cannot have the revelation of the word of God. The Bible without the Holy Spirit is like the, uh, any other book. Praise the name of the Lord. But with the Holy Spirit, we get to know the mind of Christ. Praise the name of the Lord. It is through the Holy Spirit that we understand God, that we know the mind of God. Praise the name of the Lord. It is through the Holy Spirit that we, 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 we come, we, 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 we get the revelation. It's the Holy Spirit who reveals to us the word of God. Praise the name of the Lord. He reveals to us the hidden things of the kingdom of God. Praise the name of the Lord. It's, it's, we, must, we must depend upon the Holy Spirit to reveal Jesus to us. We cannot do, know Jesus. We cannot know Jesus without the help of the Holy Spirit. Praise the name of the Lord. So Jesus said that he will send the Holy Spirit. Father will send the Holy Spirit that he may teach us all things. Hallelujah. That he may teach us all things. He is our teacher. Hallelujah. The Holy Spirit is our teacher. He is our, our counselor. Praise the name of the Lord. He is our teacher. He is our a good teacher. He teaches us the things of God, the hidden things of the God of God. Praise the name of the Lord. It is good to, 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 to enroll yourself in the school of the Holy Spirit. Praise the name of the Lord. Many of us have, have gone to, 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 to theological schools. We have uh, gone through universities and we have acquired a lot of knowledge. Praise the name of the Lord. But to have a true knowledge of God, a true revelation of whom Jesus is, we must uh, enroll ourselves into the school of the Holy Spirit. Praise the name of the Lord. Because the Holy Spirit will teach us all things. Praise God. Hallelujah. The other thing that he will uh, uh, cause you to recall, uh, praise the name of the Lord, everything that Jesus has spoken. Hallelujah. He will remind you. He will bring to your remembrance all things. Hallelujah. Many things, sometimes we forget. Even sometimes when the word has been preached unto us, we are uh, we, we we forget quickly. Uh, we, it, we forget quickly, but the Holy Spirit will uh, rem remind us. Praise the name of the Lord. The Holy Spirit will cause us to recall. Will cause us to remember. Will will bring us to. Will bring to our to our to. Will will bring to our remembrance everything that Jesus has taught us. That Jesus spoke and praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. So it is our it's our responsibility to to, to heal to the Holy Spirit. You must be have a a, 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 a sensitive a, a, a ear. Be 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 sensitive to the readings and to the voice of the Holy Spirit who lives within you. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. And when He comes on you and in you, He will help you. There are some things that you cannot. There are some things that you have you have not you have not been able to do. But with the help of the Holy Spirit, you can do it. Praise the name of the Lord. With the help uh, of the Holy Spirit, you can be bold. Uh, you can have boldness to speak the word of God. Hallelujah. We see it in the book of Acts. Acts chapter number 2. Praise the name of the Lord. Uh, let's, let's look at Acts chapter number 1 uh, from verse 8. Praise the name of the Lord. The Bible says, Acts number 1, But you shall receive power. Hey, praise God. You shall receive power. That is ability. Ability. Oh, thank you. You shall receive the ability, efficiency, and might. Amen. You shall receive power. That is ability, uh, efficiency, and, uh, and might. When the Holy Spirit has come upon you, and you shall be my witness in Jerusalem, and all Judea and Samaria and to the end of the earth. Praise the name of the Lord. So the, the other thing that the Holy Spirit does to us, he gives us a boldness. He gives us power. He gives us ability. He gives us efficiency to, to declare the word of God, to be witnesses of Jesus Christ. Praise the name of the Lord. To speak with boldness, 
the, the, the works of the Lord, that Jesus is Christ, that Jesus says, hallelujah, without the Holy Spirit you cannot have boldness to speak the word of God. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. So he gives us power. When 